Oldex, Codex Tyranids, 4th edition, Structure and Analysis, written by Phil Kelly and Andy Chambers, with additional text by Andy Hoare and Graham McNeil, pages 16 and 17, narrated by R.J. Bailey. With great thanks to Alistair for donating this copy of Codex Tyranids. File 798432 slash bracket species 43798 structure and analysis court document 382 slash XCOM date 0736998.m41 subject species record tyranid tyran tyrant xenos rating caucus theta Closed dissemination excepting Magos Biologis. Cross ref to Inquisitor Cryptman, Inquisitor Sevak, Munitorum Strategic Intelligence Collective, 827 stroke, to Magos Biologis High Command. The Tyranids are a foe as diverse as they are dangerous. Only by cataloguing and identifying each Tyranid species can we hope to understand them and therefore defeat them. The knowledge included, herein, has been bought with the lives of countless millions of the Imperium soldiers, and even now, it is not complete. Nonetheless, my studies conclude that at least 73.3% of reported Tyranid sightings can be positively identified with the aid of the diagram shown here. It should be noted that each of the Tyranid species shown here is fully mutable. Imperial authorities once believed that although some species were able to assume a bewildering array of variants, whereas others were genofixed into a particular physiology, this has since been proved to be falsehood. Though some Tyranid organisms change at a slower rate than others, all are able to adapt and evolve according to the resistance they encounter. It is because of this fact that any attempt to categorically list each and every Tyranid form is ultimately doomed to failure. Nevertheless, having common terminology for each strain of Tyranid at least aids the formulation and execution of frontline strategy. Convergent Evolution Recent reports of the splinter fleets of the known high fleets turning on each other in a full-scale cannibalistic war have been greeted with elation only by the short-sighted. When one considers the end result of any usual conflict involving Tyranids, it becomes apparent that when one high fleet fights another, no resources are expended whatsoever. In fighting of this kind, usually taking place upon the surface of a planet, is the perfect way to determine which of the two high fleets has the stronger component parts. Eventually, the weaker of the two forces is driven back and finally slaughtered. Then, as with all victims of the Tyranids, their bodies are rendered down and absorbed by the bioships of the victor. In this manner, None of the biological matter seemingly destroyed in this internecine conflict is wasted at all. Furthermore, any strengths that the losing high fleet may have assimilated or evolved over the course of its conquest thus far are absorbed at the cellular level and mingled with those of the victorious high fleet in a new hybrid generation of warriors more effective than the sum of its parts. Structure and Analysis The Tyranid genus tree shown below is necessarily incomplete. Even given the full resources of the Magos Biologis, the nature of the subject precludes an exhaustive study of its structure. Indeed, almost all of the conclusions leading to the data below are based on autopsies of incomplete specimens. Magos Biologis Locard, after Kinstrom. Excommunicate. From the top down, from left to right, individual lines of ancestry will be followed where possible as a priority. Prime Tyranid genus, 
Tyrannici, branches down and right to Norn Queen, synaptic, Tyrannicus primogenitor. Norn Queen remains a mystery. Branches directly right to Dominatrix, synaptic, Tyrannicus prepotens. Branches down to Hive Tyrant, synaptic, Tyrannicus prefector. Speculative downward connection to Tyrant Guard. DNA source debatable, Tyrannicus scutellus. Hive tyrant branches down and left to warrior genus, synaptic, Tyrannicus tyrannici. Branches down and left to Tyranid warrior, synaptic, Tyrannicus gladius. Branches down to winged warrior, synaptic, Tyrannicus gladius avius. Speculative connection. Down, left, and down to Haridan. Back to Dominatrix. Speculative connection. Right and down to Hyrajewel Hierophant. Back to Tyranid Warrior. Branches right to Variants. Over 212 variants of the Tyranid Warrior have been recovered to date. Above all other Xenos, it appears the Warrior is the most adaptable to any battlefield. The variants share a speculative connection to the Tyrant Guard. Back to Prime Tyranid Genus. Down and left connection to Classified, Classified, Classified. Branches down to Zoanthrope. Semi-synaptic. DNA source debatable. Tyrannicus animus abhorrens. Back to Classified, Classified, Classified. Branches down and right before Zoanthrope and then down to Biovore. DNA source debatable. Tyrannicus patris bolitus. Branches down to spore mines. DNA source debatable. Semi-synaptic. Bolitus minoris. Classified, classified, classified. Branches down and right to gene stealer. DNA source debatable. Semi-synaptic. Corporaptor hominis. Branches down to Broodlord, DNA source debatable, semi-synaptic, Corporaptor primus. Back to Gene Stealer, branches down and right to Yumgal Stealer. Special entry addressed later. Back to Prime Tyranid Genus, branches down and left to Gaunt Genus, Gauntai. Branches down and right to Gargoyle. Gauntai Avius. Shared speculative connection down and right to Haridin. Back to Gaunt genus. Branches down and left to Termagaunt. Gauntai Virago. Shared speculative connection downwards to Inconclusive. Classified. 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 Back to Gaunt genus. Branches down and down to Hormagaunt. Gauntai Gladius. Speculative connection branches down to Von Ryan's Leaper. Gauntai Ryanis. Back to Gaunt genus. Branches down and right to Spine Gaunt. Gauntai Spinodactylus. Back to Gaunt genus. Branches down and right to Variants. Gaunts are highly mutable. 312 separate subspecies identified to date. Back to Gaunt genus. Down, right, and down to Death Gaunt, unidentified weapon. Symbiont 731-735. Back to Warrior Genus. For clarity, Prime Tyranid Genus branches down, right to Warrior Genus. Branches down, right, down to Ravenna. Tyrannicus Ophidius Subterra. Speculative connection branches down, left, and down to Catachan Devil. Shared note with Mgal Stealer. The entries above are presumably strains of Tyranid that have become stranded from their high fleet and effectively turned feral. An autonomous adaptation to their environment without the intervention of a Norn Queen. This shows an inbuilt propensity to evolve. Reference AMB 19.tyr.har835. Back to Ravenna. Speculative connection down to Trigon, Horuspex, Malefactor, Exocrine. Back to Warrior Genus. 
branches down, right, down, right, down to Carnifex, Carnifex primus, also including Carnifex voranti, Carnifex ululaire, Carnifex arbilis, Carnifex bilius, shared speculative connection down to Hierojoule hierophant edition. I feel that Magos Lucard has let his studies stray into the realms of paranoia. Surely not every aberration and monster encountered in the galaxy has links to the Tyranid race. Inquisitor Angmar. Thought for the day. Faith, hate, and ignorance. You have been listening to Old X, Codex Tyranids, 4th Edition, Structure and Analysis. Written by Fel Kelly and Andy Chambers, with additional text by Andy Hoare and Graham McNeil, pages 16 and 17, narrated by R. J. Bailey. With great thanks to Alistair for donating this copy of Codex Tyranids. Thank you to Phil Kelly, Andy Chambers, Andy Hoare, and Graham McNeil for writing the fiction I grew up with. If you've enjoyed this, please leave a review where you found it, or like share and subscribe on YouTube, depending how you're listening. This production, like all of Oldex, is entirely unofficial and uncommercial. From an out-of-print publication, is a derivative work with all copyrights owned by Games Workshop, and is a celebration of the hobby and lore I grew up with. If you have any suggestions for other old Codex fiction for me to narrate on this podcast, you can comment, contact me on Twitter at RJ Bailey, or email robertjbailey at gmail.com. Links are in the show description.